है एवरी वन वेलकम टू एम एस एन सी आर टी स्टडीज और आज की इस वीडियो में हम रीडिंग करेंगे क्लास ट्वेल्व एन सी आर टी की बुक जोग्राफी फंडामेंटल ऑफ ह्यूमन जोग्राफी का चैप्टर सिक्स सेकेंडरी एक्टिविटीज लेट्स स्टार्ट ऑल इकोनॉमिक एक्टिविटी नेम दी प्राइमरी सेकेंडरी टेरिटरी एंड क्वार्टरीज ऑल अराउंड ऑप्टेनिंग एंड यूटिलाइजिंग रिसोर्स फॉर सर्वाइवल सेकेंडरी एक्टिविटी एड वैल्यू टू नेचुरल रिसोर्स बाई ट्रांसफॉर्मिंग रॉ मेटेरियल इन टू वेल्यूबल प्रोडक्ट्स कॉटन इन द बॉल हैज लिमिटेड यूज बट आफ्टर इट ट्रांसफॉर्म इन टू यान बिकम मोर वैल्यूबल एंड कैन बी यूज फॉर मेकिंग क्लोथ आयरन ओर कैन नॉट बी यूज डायरेक्टली फ्रॉम द माइंग बट आफ्टर बींग कन्वर्टेड इन टू स्टील इट गेट इट्स वैल्यू एंड कैन बी यूज फॉर मेकिंग मैनी वैल्यूबल मशीन टूल्स एक्सेट्रा The same is true for most of the material from the farm, forest, mine, and the sea. Secondary activity, therefore, are concerned with manufacturing process and construction infrastructure industry. Manufacturing involves a fully array of production from handicraft to modeling iron and steel and stamping out plastic toy to assembling delicate. computer component or special vehicle in each of these processes the common characteristic are the application of power mass production of identical products and specialized labor in factory setting for in the production of standardized commodities manufacturing may be done with modern power of machinery or it may still be very primitive Most of the third world country is still manufactured in the literal sense of term. It is difficult to present a full picture of all the manufacturers in the country. More emphasis is given to kind of industrial activity which involves less complicated system of production. Characteristics of modern large scale manufacturing. Modern large scale manufacturing has the following characteristics. Specialization of skill method of production. Under the craft method of factories, produce only a few species which are made to order, so the costs are high. On the other hand, mass production involves production of large quantities of standardized parts of parts by each worker performing only one task repeatedly. Manufacturing industry and manufacturing industry. Manufacturing literally means to make the make by hand. However, now it is include good made made by machine. It is essentially a process which involves transforming raw material into finished products, finished good of higher value for sale in local or dis- distant markets. Conceptually, an industry is a geographical located manufacturing. a unit maintain book of account and record under a management system as the term industry is comprehensive it is also used as synonyms with manufacturing when one uses term like steel industry and chemical industry one think of factory and processes but there are many secondary activities which are not carried on in factories such as what is now called the entertainment industry and the tourism industry etc so for clearly the longer exposure manufacturing industries used machinism machinization machinization refer to using gadget which accomplish tasks automation with aid of human thinking during the manufacturing process is the advanced stage of machinization automatic factory with feedback and closed loop com- computer control system with machine are developed to think have sprung up all over the world technological innovation technological innovations through research and development industry are an important aspect of modern manufacturing of quality control elimination based on efficiency and com- combating population organizational structure or satisfaction modern manufacturing is characterized by 
a complex machine technology extreme specialization and division of labor and for producing more good with less effort and low cost vast capital large organization executive but very crunchy and even geograph geographic distribution major concentrations of modern manufacturing have flourished in a few member of place these cover less than 10% of world's land area these nation have become the centers of economic and political power however in term of the total area covered manufacturing sites are much less conspicuous and concentrated on much smaller area than of agriculture due to greater intensity of processes for example 2.5 square kilometer of the american corn belt region include about four large farm employing about 10 to 20 workers worker supporting 5 to 100 person but this is same cloud con- con- contain several large integrated factory and employ thousands of worker why do large scale industry choose different location industry maximize profit by reducing cost therefore industry should be located at point where the production cost are minimum some of the factory influencing industry location are as under access to market the existence of market of manufactured good is most important factor in the location of industry market mean people who have demand for these good and also have the purchasing power ability to purchase to able purchase from the seller at a place remote area inhabited by a few people of a small market the developed region of europe north america japan and australia provide large global markets as the purchasing power of the people is very high the densely populated region of south south and southeast asia also providing large market some industries such as aircraft manufacturing have a global market the arm industry also global markets access to raw material raw material used by industry should be cheap and easy to transport industry based on cheap bulky and weight losing material are located close to the source of raw material such as steel sugar and cement industry perceivability is the actual factor of industry to be located closer to the source of the raw material agro processing and dairy product are produced processed close to source of the farm produce or milk supply respectively access to labor supply labor supply is an important factor in the location of industry some type of manufacturing still require skill labor increasing mechanism automation and flexibility of industrial processes have reduced the dependent of industry upon the labor access to resources sources of energy industry which are use more power are located close to the source of energy supply such as aluminium industry earlier coal was the main source of energy today hydroelectric and petroleum are also important source of energy for many industry access to transportation and commerce communication facility speedy and efficiency transport facility to carry raw material to the factory and to move finished good to the market are essential for the development of industry the cost of transport play an important role in the location of industry unit western europe and eastern north america have a highly developed transport system which has always in, include introduced induced the concentration of industry in this area modern industry is inspirably tied to transportation system improvement in transportation lead to integrated economic development and regional specialization of manufacturing communication is also an important need for industry for the exchange and management of information government policy government adopt regional policy to promote balanced economic development and and set up industry in particular area access to agglomeration economic link between industry 
Many industry benefit from nearness to a lead leader industry and other industry. These benefits are termed as algorithmic economy. Savings are derived from the linkage which exists between different industries. These factors operated together to determine industrial formation location. Food loss industry. Food loss industry can be located in a wide variety of places. They are not dependent on any specific raw material, weight losing, or otherwise. They largely depend on component parts which can be obtained anywhere. They produce in a small quantity and also employ a small labor force. These are generally not polluted polluting industry. The, Im- the important factor in their location is accessibility by road network. <coughs> Classification of manufacturing industry. Manufacturing industry are classified on the basis of their size, input, raw materials, output product and ownership. Industry based on size, the amount of capital invested, the number of workers employed and volume of production determine the size of industry. Accordingly, industry may be classified into household or cottage, small scale and large scale. Classification of Industries Household Industries or Cottage Manufacturers It is the smallest manufacturing unit. The association use local raw material and simple tools to produce everyday goods in their home with their with help the, of their family member or part time live. Finished product may be for consumption in the same household, for sale in local village market, or for better. Capital and transportation do not wield much influence as the type manufacturing has low commercial significance and most of the tools are devised locally. <coughs> Some common everyday products produced in the sector manufacture include food stuff, fabric and mat container, tools, furniture, shoes, and figures from wood, lot, and forest, shoes, hung, and other articles from leather, pottery and brick from clay and stone, goldsmith make jewelry of gold, silver, and bronze. Some artifacts and crafts are made out of bamboo wood obtained locally from the forest. Small scale manufacturing. Small scale manufacturing is distributed from household industry by its production, technique and place of manufacturer workshop outside the home cottage of producer. This type of manufacturing uses a local raw material, simple powered ravine, machine and semi skilled labor. It provides employment and raises local purchasing power. Therefore, countries like China, India, Indonesia, Brazil, etc. have developed labor-intensive small-scale manufacturing in order to provide employment to their population. Large-scale manufacturing Large-scale manufacturing involves a large market, various raw materials, enormous energy, specialized workers, advanced technology, assembly line, mass production, and large capital. This kind of manufacturing developed in the last 200 years in the United Kingdom, Northeastern USA, and Europe. Now it has diffused to almost all over the world. On the basis of system of large scale manufacturing, the world which is initial region may be grouped under two board type, main, namely traditional large scale industry region, which are thickly clustered in a few more developed countries. High technology, large scale industry region which have diffused to less developed countries. Industry based input raw material on the basis. Industry based on input raw material. On the basis of raw material used to industry are classified as agro based, mineral based, chemical based, forest based, and animal based. Agro based industry. Agro Processing involves the processing of raw material from the field and the farm into finished product of rural and urban market. Major agro processing industry are food processing, sugar pickles, fruit juice, beverages, species, specs, species and all fact and textile, rubber, etc. Food processing, agro food processing include canining, producing cream, fruit processing and confectionery. 
while some prevention prevention reversing techniques such as drying fat fertilizing and pickling have been known since ancient time these had limited application to cater to the pre industrial evolution demands mineral based industry these industry use mineral as a raw material some industry use various metallic mineral which contain ferrous such as iron or steel industry but some use non ferrous metallic mineral such as aluminum copper jewelry industry many industry use non metallic mineral such as cement and pottery industry chemical based industry such industry use natural chemical mineral example mineral oil petroleum is used to petrochemical industry salt sulfur and potash potash industry also use natural mineral chemical industry are also based on raw material obtained from wood and coal synthetic fiber plastic etc are other example of chemical based industry forest based raw material used in industry the forest provide many major and minor minor product which are used as raw material timber for furniture industry wood bamboo and grass for paper industry lack of lack industry from forest animal based industry leather leather from leather industry and wool from woolen textile are obtained from animal beside ivory is also obtained from elephant tusks industry based on output products you have seen some machine and tool made for of iron or steel the raw material for such machine and tool is iron and steel which is itself an industry the industry whose products are used to make other goods by using them as raw material are basic industry can you identify the links iron steel machine iron steel machines for cotton textile industry cloth for use by consumer the consumer good industry produce good which are consumed by consumer directly for the example industry produce bread and biscuit tea soap toiletries paper for writing television etc are consumer good on non basic industry industry based on ownership a public sector industry are owned by managed by government in india there are where a number of public sector undertaking psus socialized country have many state owned industry mixed economic have both public and private sector enterprises private sector industry are owned by individual investors these are managed by private organization in capitalist country industries are generally owned privately joint sector industry are managed by joint stocks companies or sometimes the private and public sector together establish and manage the industry can you make a list of such industry traditional large scale industry region these are based on heavy industry often located near coal field and engaged in metal some smelting heavy engineering chemical manufacture or textile production these industry are known as smokestacks industry traditional industries industrial region can be recognized by high production of employment in manufacturing industry high density housing often of inferior type and poor services attractive environment for example pollution waste sea heights and so on problem of unemployment ml immigration or direct like and land area caused by closure of factories because of worldwide fall in demand the ruhr coal field germany this has been one of the most industrial regional regions of europe for a long time coal and iron and steel form the basics of the economy but as the demand of coal declined the industry started sinking even after the iron ore was exhausted the industry remained using imported or bought by waterways to the ruhr the raw reason is impossible for 80% of germany total steel production changes in the industry structure have lead to decay of some area and there are problem of industry waste and pollution 
The feature proximity of the rohor is based on less on the product of coal and steel for which it was initially famous and more on the new industry like the huge opium car assembly plants new chemical plants universities out of town town shopping center have appeared resulting in new rohor landscape iron and steel industry the iron and steel industry form the base base of the base of all other industry and therefore it is called a basic industry it is basic because it provide raw material for the other industry such as machine tools used for future production it may also be called a heavy industry because it uses large quantity of bulky raw material and it produces are also heavy iron is extracted from iron ore by smelting in a blast furnace with carbon and limestone the molten iron is cooled and moduled molded to form pig iron which is used for converting into steel by adding strengthening material like manganese the large integrated steel industry is traditionally located close to source of raw material iron ore chlor coal manganese and limestone or at place where these could be easily brought example near port but in many steel mine access to market is more important than input these are less expensive to build and operate and can be located near market because of abundance of scrap metal which is main input traditionally most of the steel was produced at largely integrated plant but many mills are limited to just one step process steel making and are gaining ground distribution the industry is one of the most complex and capital intensive industry and is concentrated in the advanced country of north america Europe and Asia in USA most of the production common comes from the north affiliation region great lake region and the atlantic coast the industry have also moved toward the south state of alabama petersburg area is now losing ground it has now become the rust bowl of usa and europe due to germany france belgium lomexburg the netherlands and russia are the leading producer the important steel center are scunthrope port talbot birmingham and sheffield in the uk distributes distributorg dot 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 mum dusseldorf and isan in germany lee Kruistot and St. Stani in France and M- Moscow St. Petersburg Leptex Tula in Russia and Krivoy Rog and Donetsk in Ukraine in Asia the important centers include Nagasaki and Tokyo Yokohama in Japan Shanghai Tencent and Wolfen in China and Jamshedpur, Kultiburpur, Durgapur, Rohirkela, Bela, Barkera, Silman, Visakhapatnam and Bahadivati in India. Constantly your atlas to locate these places is sent. Cotton textile industry. Cotton textile industry has been their subsector. Example: hand loom, power loom, mill, mill sector. Handloom sector is labor intensive and provide employment to semi skilled worker it requires small capital investment by the Mahatma Gandhi properties hardy as part of independence movement this sector involving spinning wheel weaving and fishing form of the fabric the power loom sector introduced machine and become less labor intensive and the volume of production increased Cotton textile mill sector is highly capital intensive and produce much fine cloth in bulk. Cotton textile manufacturing require good quality cotton as raw material. India, China, USA, Pakistan, Uzbekistan, Egypt produce more than half of the world raw cotton. The UK, new European country 
Japan also produced cotton textile made from imported yarn. Europe alone accounts from nearly half of the world cotton import. The industry has to face very stiff competition with synthetic fiber. Hence, it has now shown a declining trend in many countries with the scientific advantage advance, advancement and technological improvement in the structure of industry chain. For example, Germany recorded constantly growth in coastal textile industry since Second World War. Till the sensitive but now it has been declined, it has shifted to less development country where labor costs are low. Concept of high technology industry in high technology or simple high tech is the large latest generation of manufacturing industry. Manufacturing activity. It is the better understood as the application of intensive research and development R and D effort leading to the manufacturing or uh, manufacturer of products of an advanced scientific and engineering character. Professional while co dollar worker make up a large share of the total work workforce. These highly skilled specialists just greatly outnumber the actual production worker. Robotic and assembly line, computer and I design, CAD and manufacturing electronic control of some melting and refining process and the, uh, and the constant development of new chemical pharmaceutical products are notable example of high tech industry. Neatly spaced low modern display of the office plant lab building rather than massive assembly structure, factory and storage area mark the high tech industry landscape plant business park for high tech startup have been part of regional and local development scheme. High tech industry, which are regionally concentrated, self sustained, and highly specialized, are called technologies. Technopolis. The Silicon Valley near San Francisco and San Silicon Forest near Seattle are examples of technopolis. Are some technopolis developing in India? Manufacturing contributes significantly to the world economy. Iron and steel textile, automobile, petrochemical, and electronics are some of the world's most important manufacturing industry. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.